Welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. So last time we had exploding barrels. And I sort of want to watch out for that. No. And those damn pirates. I think you get a joy pendant from those ones specifically. Seagulls, don't block my reign of vision, please. I sort of need it. Alright, let's get this one in our C chart as well because I'm I have ADHD on getting everything done. I mean no CD. I, well, I like my C chart being complete, like I like my maps and Oracle Seasons and Ages being 100 percent complete. It's, it's just who I am. And so far we got a good amount done. So this is Star Island. Very nice island if I say so myself. An arrow that can freeze anything! Like the ice arrows in Ocarina of Time? Hey, hey, that's another game. I'm not spoiling this game, viewers. But hey, maybe he's hinting out we'll get up in this one, too. Who knows? Anyone's played the Zelda game, I mean, honestly. So basically, if you want to we kind of repeat the information, throw it up, he's a bait at him, yada yada. Oh, that must be what I'm here for. Okay. Let's see, let's open up the C charts. Okay. Star Island is one of these. Uh, no, it's not 37, I believe. Uh, nope, forget Tingle's chart. Don't need Beetle's chart. Oh, there we go. Okay. Stop, stop, stop. I so passed it. I know I did pass it. No. There we go. Let's see here. Yeah, I passed it. Okay, just cruise. Can't sail against the wind. We'll get there. Alright, am I on it? Stop. Let's try the grappling hook. Man, they guess we got the grappling hook from Medley. Man, she's making us rich and she doesn't even know it. I wonder if she even knew we could use the grappling hook in such a greedy fashion. Oh, man. Well, speaking of Medley, my little sister is cosplaying Medley. Oh. That is not what I was expecting. I guess I have to actually visit the island. <laughs> well, there's 200 more rupees! Yeah, more money! Sweet! I mean, I can always use more money in this game, considering that this game is the one that needs the most money. Besides Phantom Hourglass. Oh yeah, it's one of these. Shoot, at least we have tons of bombs. So I'll throw a bomb here. Uh, let's throw another bomb here. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. Oh, he got destroyed by a bomb. Sucks to be you guys. Oh, money. Hey, you know what you guys forget is I have a Master Sword now. Sure looks a little dark, but you know, Dark Master Swords are cool too. Go away. I don't think these guys stop coming, so just keep hammering away at them. Blow what you need. And try not to hit by your own bombs. Oh, there we go. That's the one I'm looking for. Yeah. I should know you guys don't have anything that good. Oh, they do go away eventually. I'm, I'm thinking of a different area where they don't go away, no matter how many times you kill them, and they don't give enough money for it to be considered farming. More like super annoying. Oh yeah, this island. Okay, come here. So basically, just kill them. That's all there is to it. Kill the enemies. And if you use the parry attack, it's a one-hit kill, so that's always good too. Ah! Goodbye. Ooh, 10 rupees. I'll be taking that. Greedily, I'll be taking it. Uh-oh. Moblins! With sticks! But hey, I got a sword, so they don't scare me. Oh, I killed the second one too? I don't know my own strength. Oh, now they're taking out the swords. It's getting serious. Like a fire emblem. Or are they call it reinforcements. You're like, God damn it. Actually, I wouldn't mind I'll get a fire emblem game in the future. Maybe Fire Emblem 7, Blazing Swords. Because that is my favorite Fire Emblem game, to be completely honest. Ooh. Now they got the real moblins. I guess you can call the other guys Bogoblins. Anyways. I want your necklace. Okay, now I'll kill you. Ha! Okay, there we go. Oh crap. Hey, you punched your own guy. 
How mean! Don't you wish the Dark Knights and Twilight Princess would hit each other? That would be pretty cool. Yeah, he's just gonna block a lot, so I guess I'll just ignore him for a little bit. Hey, what you doing? No! My money! Oh good, I got it. <laughs> it's like, no money and I get for it. Like, what the heck? That'd be funny if I got hit over money, huh, viewers? It's like, Master Linnet, why are you so greedy? Because I am. I like my money. Especially considering how hard it is to get tons of money. Heck, I can almost wear that heart piece now. Although I probably won't come back until I can afford both of those items, but... You know what I mean, viewers. It's great to have a lot of money. And I'll be farming most of my money off-screen, but... We got heart piece number 22. Very nice. Um... Let's see, what other side quests do I have left to do? At least the list ain't as long as it was last time, huh, viewers? F5. Did I already go to C1? Let's see. C1. I think I did. Maybe I did go to C1. At least, I think I did. Okay, now I gotta find my boats. I think it's on this side. Thought it was on this side. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we're gonna go to C1 while I'm here, and if we don't need to go to C1, I'll just edit it out. Because I can't remember if we've been to C1 already. We might have. I mean, isn't the first rupee upgrade like a orange rupee? Rupee first upgrade, and the second one's a blue one. Maybe I just I got it later in my notes, and that's why I have it down, but if I don't have it, then it is worth getting. Otherwise, skip it. So I'm just going to sail this way for a little bit, and if I don't have this rupee uh, purse upgrade, I'll just keep this all in, not edit anything, and if I do have it, then I'll just edit it out and go straight to the next heart piece I want to get. Otherwise, that's pretty much it, so it's no pain, no game. I mean, if I have it... Okay, I'll edit this out if I don't. No. I mean, if I don't have it, I'll, I'll... I'll show this all on screen, so... Okay, to the Northern Fairy Island. Although I thought I had it, but maybe we need bombs to get this one. But I thought I got this one already. Probably did. So I'll just take the time to sail there, and I'll be right back. Okay, I made it to C1. I'm starting to think I did get this in my run, but, well, let's see if I have it yet or not. Looks like I did. There's no, nothing blocking the way. Well, wait a minute. Maybe I didn't. Oh, I didn't get it yet. Well, <laughs> for some reason, I thought I got this one. Well, I think I got this one. Is she just going to refresh me? Hello. Oh. Okay, maybe I didn't get this one. Doesn't, I mean, it looks like I haven't. I mean, it's like a cinematic cutscene and everything, and there's no, just a fairy pool. Sweet, more money. Well, actually, she's not giving us money, but, well, we can hold more money. Oh yeah, now we can hold the 5,000 rupees. Oh, I'm so greedy. Well, in video games, I know. You can't really be greedy in real life if you're making 825 an hour. <laughs> Yeah, especially with bills and college fees and cars and... Oh. Yeah, and dating's never cheap anymore either. Either. I mean... Unless you take her to McDonald's, it ain't gonna be a cheap date, I'll tell you that. Sweet! Alright, now where I want to go to is F5. You viewers remember F5, right? 
I'll give you a few seconds to think of it. Bomb Island! What do you mean that was two seconds? Well, regardless, we're gonna go to Bomb Island. Ah. There we go. So we have to warp the Forest Haven because that's the closest island to it. So, I'm gonna warp the Forest Haven, go to Bomb Island, get what I want, and then go to the Forsaken Fortress. Because, because we're awesome like that. And it's time to get our sister back. Because, yeah, we gotta save her eventually, right? Oh! Actually, I want this beetle. He, I want to stock up on, on my stuff. That way I can, uh, uh, get lots of money and farm it later. Because after the Forsaken Fortress, I do want to farm lots of money. Uh, what do you mean bashful look on my face? You're just laughing to freak me out, aren't you, Beetle? Anyways, you don't really need Hayori pairs anymore after you use the Hayori pairs to get two heart pieces. As far as I know, that's the most you'll need the Hayori pairs for. But always keep one in handy in case you do need one. And you can just save and reset in case you need another one. And you don't want to go all the way back to Beetle to get it. So, basically, buy tons of bait so you can all get tons of money! I mean, 10 rupees for a bait and you get 10 rupees for hitting the fish once and you get 3 servings? I mean, how could you beat that? That's amazing! And I'm greedy. We, we talked about this, viewers. Alright, now let's go north up to Bomb Island because now that we have bombs, we can actually do some more stuff with Bomb Island. I thought I told you viewers to remember that island for later anyways, but... Well, if I didn't, now let's go back there. And get these side quests finally out of the way. The is the Battle of the Gale is awesome. We can warp anywhere we want. Oh, not any square specifically. Can you imagine how long it take you to get to the square you actually want if it was every single square? Sure, it would be convenient, but it'd take a long time to get to the square you want. Well, okay, not that long, but it'd still be annoying. Uh, I love Wind Waker. And Twilight Princess, an Ocarina of Time, an Oracle of Seasons, an Oracle of Ages, and the original Legend of Zelda for the NES. I like Leaks of the Past a lot too. After I get through my break of Zelda games as far as Let's Playing them goes, I think my next one will be either Oracle of Ages or A Link to the Past. It'll it'll be one or the other. I, because I want to do both of those uh, Zelda games really bad as well. But I've already let's play Twilight Princess, Ocarina of Time, you know, I'm doing a, a high quality version of Twilight Princess. I'm doing Wind Waker, and I've also done Skyward Sword. And to me, that's a lot of Zelda games already, so maybe I should take a little break from Zelda games. Well, I want to. I want to do Mario, Kirby, and Resident Evil 4. And I would like to do... Uh, what other game I like the LP? Oh yeah, Kingdom Hearts. I like the LP that game sometimes too. Now I've done a test run on it yet, so I'll have to get ready for that. Well, I did one a couple years ago, but well, I think those notes are too old to use now. As far as my memory goes on it, I'll probably forget a lot of things. So, so I, I do want to write a new set of notes for Kingdom Hearts. Because I love that game to death, just to be honest. Kingdom Hearts is one of my favorite video game series. Sure, there are a couple of Kingdom Hearts games I don't like so much, but, uh... 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 Hello? I don't have the can of Samaria, so... Come here so I can... No, oh, goddammit! Ah! Oh, I burn Link's butt. That's how nice I am. Oh, I did see a cool video called Smashing Pots on YouTube. So, considering you're probably on YouTube watching this video, if not, go to it. Uh... Smashing Pots. Don't attack me. I've done nothing to you. Okay, I, I hurt your brother because I want to use him, but... Well, he has reasons. Nora's a sister. Basically, uh, these uh, college students, like myself, got together and they made a, a video about violinist smashing pots. Like this. And it was from, like, the area in Ocarina of Time. I thought it was pretty cool. Game. Throw me a bone here. Okay, be careful. Okay, hit the switch. I'll cause the fire over there to go away. You know, for some reason, I thought I got this heart piece already. Oh, crap. I hate it when I do that. 
because I lose a heart and then I have to go back to the beginning and I look like an idiot. Oh, you only lose a fourth of a heart from that? I I thought you lost more than that. Okay, never mind. Okay, get this guy. Crap. Can I use my leaf to blow him there? <laughs> no. Oops. Well, I guess I'll get this guy next. Don't you dare! Gosh, damn it. I really suck at this. Is he still on the wall? Okay, good. I'll take one of you bastards. Here, let's have you come this way. That way when they roll, they don't like... Oh, they don't roll to the freaking lava. Really? You're gonna be annoying? All I wanna do is this. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Okay, you're next. Damn it. There we go. What you wanna do is take these guys and throw them into a hole. Kinda like how you're throwing those walnuts into a hole. It's pretty much the same thing. Once you get into the hole, it gets rid of the fire. And we need two of them. And don't use your parry. I don't want them to die. And I think I said that before, actually. Deja vu. So throw them. There we go. And that reveals, well, gets rid of the fire around the treasure chest. And don't worry about them crawling out of it, because now you don't have, there's no timer. I should say. That really suck if there was, but luckily there's not. That way we can get heart piece number 23. Sweet. Only one more to go to get out of the heart container. Anyways, viewers. Oh, I almost missed my turn there. No, I almost jumped into the lava. Forget it. Just take me to the door. I don't, I hate this place. I hate Bomb Island. It sucks. This ain't one of my favorite heart pieces to get. I don't like it. So yeah, if you didn't get the heart piece, well, the door's gonna shut on you, you're gonna have to get that, well, scorpion looking guy to go back onto the switch. So, next time, we're gonna go and attempt to save our sister again. But will we succeed this time, or will that damn bird get the better of us? Find out next time, well, let's play The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Have a good day. Where the hell is my boat? Game? I... I lost my boat. Oh. Okay, never mind. I found my boat. Alright. I'll just meet you guys outside of Forsaken Fortress off-screen. So I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.